So in this video, we're going to do an update on the Black Pastel Pin Pie. So stay right there. Good evening, YouTube! Woo! We, we skipped that a couple times. And, uh, and a couple of previous videos. Yeah, well, not the live stream, but the last one. No, uh, somebody beat us to it in the live stream, though. Yeah, they did. <laughs> on, on, online, we got, we got, yeah. Anyway, this video, uh, we figured we'd bring you an update on our most recent clutch that has now all shed out. They look fantastic. Um, if you followed us on Instagram, you've seen pictures of some of these. Uh, if you were part of the live stream, you definitely saw some of these. Um, so we're, we're going to actually do a formal update video for all those people that didn't make the live stream. Um, so this will be a condensed version for that. So we're going to take a look at this clutch. Uh, they, they came out really good, man. I'm yeah. really pleased with the way this clutch uh you know, kind of came together. Yeah, they look great. The odds was awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> so for sure. Six eggs. One was uh, infertile from the beginning, and out of the five eggs, we hit four pies. Four pies from yeah. a visual to a head. Yeah. And uh, real quick, what's what was the pairing for? Because uh, that was a visual piece that we uh, introed for. But... Right. So the uh, mom was a black pastel pinstripe het pied, yep. and dad is a albino pied. Yeah. So. So not uh, a lot in the mix per se, uh, but definitely some power with the albino sitting in the background. And sure. uh, uh, yeah, there's there's that that pin. I'm I'm back and forth with that. We we talked about it in a live stream, and I was like, nah, it's just a pin pied. And I spent a lot more time on Morph Market and now we doing, think it's doing other, pie. some <laughs> other research and looking at actual pin pieds that are out there that have like way more pattern in their bodies. Um, like so saddles that are all connected and run the whole length of the body uh, to like uh, having stripes and pixelation in there. And, <clears throat> and this is just lacking with that. So yep. we'll see. So uh, let's do it. Let's get it done. Doublehead albino pied. Uh, this is a female. So this girl, once she's got enough meals in her, will be available. We're not going to hold her back. She's just that that classic pinstripe. Totally solid on top. She'll cooperate with me. seeing double we got two female black pastel pied head albinos would have never guessed that i was going to hit two of these in this clutch uh very very similar they they both look exactly the same uh very little little pattern very high white i don't know if you notice when the camera's over here <laughs> uh so they only have pattern on their heads Nowhere else, everywhere else on the body is completely white. Nothing on the bellies. And not on the tail tip either. Yeah, same as that one too. 
So we're gonna get some meals into these gals, um, these young ladies, and then we're gonna determine which one we're gonna keep, and the other one will be available. Again, female, black pastel, pied, head albinos. And the other two males are available as well? There's only one other male that'll be available. That's the regular pied and the black uh, so, black. Oh, so the pinstripe double hat was, was a female. A female. Oh, yep. nice. Yep. Okay. Yep, definitely hit good, uh, good odds uh, between males and females. All right. And the cream of the crop, would you say? Yeah, I would definitely yeah. say. We're we're definitely feeling that this is a black pastel pinstripe pied. Uh, just as, uh, yeah, I'm speechless. <laughs> the colors on this thing are so freaking awesome. Like the the pattern looks really cool here at the top, and then everything else, there's really nothing. You may get a couple specks here and there in the in the patterns, but it's kind of like a uh, if you work with any picture editing programs, kind of like doing the smudging type effect on, on the pictures. That's what the patterns look like on here. Uh, the, the color, yeah, it doesn't really pick up in the video. Uh, it's very yeah, you, orangey. You, you kind of lose the, the high, the, like that intense orange uh, tracing that go around the edges, but, yep. but and it's pretty close. It looks pretty good. And this is, uh, I don't remember if I said it or not, this is a boy. This one is definitely staying here. Uh, and he, and the color to white ratio is perfect. I like it. Uh, it's not too much white, not too little white. And, and it's so cool just to kind of see how the, the eye bands connect to the back and kind of start that little stripe there on the back of the head. It's like perfect contrast between everything yeah this guy looks really good for sure yeah again we believe black pastel pinstripe pied yeah for albino and i know we've gone back and forth with it but um i'm kind of leaning back toward the black pastel pin pied yeah um a little bit more now after seeing more pin pieds so time will tell once we breed once he breeds we'll know for sure yep sweet Dude, his so cool. <laughs> He's awesome. Man, how about that clutch? Dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, that was that's great. I mean, to hit the odds is is you know is one thing, and then to have all the albino back behind that. I mean, that's just like crazy power. That's that's like that's what you you know really breeding for the future for uh, to be able to do things like that. You know, and then you know you you have some albino hip pieds with combos and some combo yeah. double hats. So you know, once you start mixing this stuff together in another year or two, like, dude, it's gonna be yeah, it's, it's gonna, gonna be take insane. Off. So yeah, I've been yeah. kind of been kind of working that project from a while, for a while. I started with two double hats, yeah. produced produced a male double visual last year, or actually not last year, but the year before, and then last year hit a um, double visual female. So where i'm building it it's taken a little bit but we're getting yeah, there it's getting there <laughs> um so i have sample t-shirts for the military stuff um that are being delivered i think tomorrow the next day uh for me to take a look at but all that stuff is on the website it is able to be ordered mm -hmm. um so have free reign. There's multiple colors, sizes, all that stuff is is there. It's print on demand. It, it gets shipped, drop shipped from the printer, uh, right to you guys. Um, and that's the easiest way for us to do it. You know, to, to try to keep different colors and different sizes and all that stuff has been really a challenge yeah, and a balancing yeah. act uh, for us. So this will will definitely you know keep that stuff uh, in in order for you, and it'll be printed right on demand. Um, the other thing, if you follow us on Instagram, that we're really kind of excited <laughs> about, I mean, we've been kind of building toward this, um, and we've had a, a couple ideas floating around and we hadn't really solidified any of it. Um, but what we have done is we've given a t-shirt to somebody that, you know, if you spend a thousand dollars with us or more, whether it's one purchase or cumulative, um, we send a t-shirt to you. Uh, it may not be right away if I don't have your size, but we've uh, printed those or whatever, and then had them sent. Um, we wanted to make that 
process a little more exclusive. Yeah. And um, so what we did is we, well, I shouldn't say we, Matt um, basically did all the legwork. I, ha I had, had this and, vision. And, and, yeah, in my brain, and, and then we talked back and forth about things. And um, the, cum the accumulation of all that stuff is in the what we're calling the one percenter shirt. Um, it doesn't say one percenter on it, but it's really for uh, those customers that spend a thousand dollars with us in one shot or more, and that's the only way you're going to be able to get this shirt. Um, it's not going to be print on demand. It's not going to be available any other time of year. Uh, we might do like a like a, a giveaway or something, and the winner will will be that shirt. And we might do that sooner than later. Those sample runs will be here um, soon as well. And uh, what's nice with that is we could send that anywhere in the world. So, right, right. Um, so we're really excited about the shirt. It came out really, really cool. So if you get a chance, you can pop over to Instagram. You can take a look at that. And then uh, quick updates for where we're going to be. Um, again, like I've been saying the past couple of videos, I'm going to be in Dallas, Fort Worth uh, from the 5th through the 8th and then we'll be at White Plains on the 9th yep. and then I'll be back to Arlington what is that 13 14 15 something like that that following weekend right um, so yeah lots of busy stuff and then the next show after that is what April it's good New question. Hampshire I think it's April yeah it's a big yeah it's, it's yeah. a big jump February to <laughs> yeah to, uh, a good size jump there may be Long Island or something so we may uh, take a look at that I reached out to the uh, the guy that runs the shows and see if we can get a table for New Hampshire um, but there may be something in the meantime for that yep um, but I don't know anything you want to add no um, we covered where we're gonna be going snakes we covered I think yeah. we got it all covered all right cool <laughs> so uh, thanks again as always we really appreciate everybody taking a little bit of time uh, to spend it with us um, much 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 appreciated thank you very much and we'll see you guys on the next video take care peace ready to do this let's do it no shirt change it didn't work yeah no shirt change <laughs> they're coming they're in the mail <laughs> they are yeah In this video, we're going to do a quick update on the Black Pastel Pinstripe Hide Clutch. In this video, we're going to do an update on the Black Pastel Pin Pied Clutch, so stick around. Stick around. Stick around. So in this video, we're going to do an update on the Black Pastel Pin Pied, so stay right there. Yeah. <laughs>